Apostolics. Uh, he showed it to my stream oh. yesterday. And I thought, you know, he was like, yeah, man, what are you commentating? So I told him what I was commentating. And he was like, yeah, man, hope to see you in there. But before, I guess he didn't, uh, guess he didn't, uh, climb the, you know, climb the ranks there. He'll he'll be there in uh, Losers' Quarterfinals. He's waiting Losers for... Losers' Quarterfinals, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. So we're not going to start off with him. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, we got Ethan and Lil Cap. Lil Cap, uh, I mean, look at this. He's got the Trucker Bodvar. Would you expect anything differently? It's been years at this point where that is just Lil Cap through and yeah, through. Yeah, yeah. There we go. So Ethan, me he's, been yeah, he's, been pick. Yeah. he's been rocking this Atori pick. Yeah, he's Ethan's been rocking this Atori pick. He's all about you know the sword. He loves the spear. Absolutely, he needs that zoom speed, and we'll see if he can uh, go toe to toe with Lil Cap right now. Yeah, so look at man. Uh, I'd say you know he's been he's been kind of holding it down in multiple games, but uh, obviously most people will know him for his Brawlhalla gameplay. I've known this uh, dude since like pretty much since like 2016, 17. That's when I first started getting into the scene, mm. and he was already at the top. So he's been keeping his uh, reign of dominance here in this game for uh, quite some time, man. You know, whenever we be able to count him out again, and when it comes to Brawlhalla, I feel like almost anybody in the top 25 can make it anywhere in top eight. So. Ooh. Yeah, and I mean, you you especially see that with how this tournament in particular has gone. It's a it's a little bit of a shake up. Some players returning to their old favorites. Uh, a bit of a change from like the experimentate. Oh my gosh, went for the big side signature. This damage is piling up. I'm looking for a knockout real soon. Yeah, man, this is. I mean, the damage is piling up for both sides. What? Uh, I don't. I don't know. Why if that would was you purpose, talk but there? Goodbye. <laughs> like, what a perfect oh punish on that taunt. Though. What are you doing out here? Like. I mean, yeah, taunt to get bodied, true combo. There is a saying as old as time. Oh yeah, so I just, I mean, that is, that's exactly what happened there, man. I don't know what the taunt made. I don't, know, I don't know how you even get that as a like a input error, but <laughs> regardless, he uh, ended up paying dearly for that. So now, down uh, by a little bit, having a hard time finding this stock off of a uh, low cap just yet. I mean, low cap sitting in the deep red too, not gonna be able to survive the mm. second uh, onslaught of the down light to recovery. Yeah, it took a little bit extra there, just because this is a very tall map. So getting knockouts off the top, where like the sword downlight recovery is one of your main knockout options, it takes that little bit of extra juice to get it going. Yeah. So just like that, though, man, it looks, looks like he's able to at least kind of get himself back into this game. Not too much of a difference in color between our uh, uh, competitors. In fact, almost dead even if you're uh, looking at it. Looks like Lil Cap actually getting uh, going to lose the lead here just a little bit. Uh oh. Oh, he tried it. Yeah, I mean, mm. you know, now he's looking for these signatures where he was looking for the taunt before. So, Ethan's got his head in the game. He is he is swinging away right now. Oh, good. A good Ooh. catch right there. Knowing that he was going to try to jump up and over him. Just goes for that nice recovery. Catching him. He couldn't even get his... I feel like that was so quickly that even on reaction, he was going to be able to get out of his, uh, his dodge. So, Oh, yeah. The choices were made. Like, Yeah, yeah. All right. Ooh. Little Cap Stomp finding sider. yet another. That's the classic, oh, nice man. You know, it's Definitely the, the classic. Cap, <laughs> the Zen, he just like sits there. Sometimes he'll spot dodge, but it's the stomp side air, the coach pitch. All right. With that being said, man, we're still down. We're down to our last stop on the first game between our competitors. Uh, Little Cap was in the lead for quite a bit of time, but it seems like Ethan has been able to kind of stifle that, keep himself in front ever since he uh, took the lead on the second stock. Yeah, he's doing a great job playing the range game of the spear right now, whether it's just tacking him with a couple neutral lights, maybe some side lights, but the damage build is clear. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he is he is definitely jabbing him up with these neutral lights and it seems it's seeming as though okay, wait a minute. Ooh. Oh my god, he was right there. Just oh, a game held it for of like inches. a slight second, that was it. Yo, he's shaving his eyebrows. That's what yeah, he's yeah. looking for. Okay, oh hold my on, gosh. Man. Looks like Ethan's getting a little, a little sig heavy right now. And it's going to be oh. enough. There it is. Wow. I think if he did that at ground level, it might not have knocked out. It was just because it was gravity canceled at that little bit of extra height. Yeah, was, that was definitely necessary, man. I was wondering. I was like, I don't know how he's going to uh, take this. Because I feel like the sigs were not. Like, he was getting super sig heavy. Uh, at oh, the yeah. End. It was taking quite a bit of damage from it. And I was like, I don't think this is going to be the way to take the game. But uh, luckily for him, he found that downlight to recovery. Finished him off. Ooh, and we're running it right back to Demon Island. So I I, I, I personally like this map just because it's like a nice open area. It feels uh, kind of honest. 
until you get to the offstage game, because there's very small walls, it makes it difficult to come back, edge guards become extremely potent, so yeah. it, it's like the game can shift on a dime. Yeah, it's not a, not a small a shipwreck, but I mean, it's, it's, you know, it's definitely neighboring it. Oh, yeah. So, <laughs> gotta watch yourself as you're trying to recover, man. You don't get that full wall uh, at your disposal. And then just like that, I mean, these guys are definitely straight up sword fighting right now. Yo, the classic Same. duel. Yeah. Sabres at dawn. Okay, I like this, though. He's kind of keeping him in the air, making it real. Oh, that would have been beautiful if he's able to make that work. Oh, oh what a my gosh. Still living. Man, that was beautiful so nice, though. Both of them. Yeah, that's the thing. So we've seen Ethan use that signature before, particularly in gravity cancel situations where he doesn't have the... Oh, the stop sign. Just read it. Read it up real close. How's your vision? 2020? <laughs> so you might need some contacts for this one. Okay. All right, now we we're back to the sword duel. Quickly taken away. Not too much damage put onto Ethan. He was able to, you know, stymie that little bit of run that little cap was putting on him. Okay, hold on now. He is trying so hard to get uh, a little extra damage here. Doesn't want the game to escape him too much, but... Oh, okay. All right, I gotta tell you, so now that's a couple times we've seen this tournament. The stomp into the bear, there's a massive dodge window in there. Like, yeah, yeah, a lot yeah. of times you can even, like, jump out of there. It's when you catch people that are, you know, they're expecting the full combo. You'll stomp side air, yeah, I don't need to burn my dodge trying to get away from that. You're just gonna do it. But you make them eat the full bear signature for it. That's, 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 just, that's just a mix-up. A mix-up that shouldn't work because, obviously, you have the options to get out of Woo! it, but... You're also like, you know, you're, you're thinking you're thinking three steps ahead, basically, and he's just going for the basic. Uh, I'm gonna go for the neutral sig. What's good? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Nothing is a foregone conclusion when there's a wild bear sitting in the wings. Yeah, hold on. Oh, try that side stick right there. Not gonna find it. Neutral air. Still one of my favorite moves in the game, man. I feel like I've never ever not disliked spear neutral air. <laughs> Listen, you know, if you're worried that they're a bit too close to you, it doesn't matter where. Just press that button. If they're within arm's reach, they'll get caught. Okay. Ooh, starting to get a little capped into the orange, looking Ooh. for the knockout range. There's that spear neutral air you love so much. Yeah, and it is we're doing wonders for him right now. Little cap does not... Well, he was able to touch the stage. He gets back to stage two. But he has not been able to get uh, to the middle stage. Oh and when he looks God. for the weapon just gets destroyed oh man yeah ethan's used that signature exceptionally well uh, twice in that game i mean the one was the gravity cancel that caught him from so far away it's a quick deceptive teleport it reaches so high and you know i know demon island has a really tall ceiling but when you're that damaged it doesn't even matter it'll knock out yeah Three, two, all right man so that was uh wasn't i'm just a nice little play right here from uh ethan but Unfortunately, I feel like uh, Lil Cap is not really having the answers here to get himself back into this game. But as we were talking about into the, in our server earlier, man, these these NA games can go anywhere between a quick 3-0s to uh, now what could potentially be a game five last out, last hit type situation. So we'll see what happens. Yeah, it, it is kind of weird to think that like both of the matches going into winners finals, they went the full distance. And man, even game five was so incredibly close. And here right now, Ethan is sitting 2-0 in the set. He just needs to win this. And this is where it really matters, because this yeah. is the lower bracket. It's double elimination tournament. If you get knocked out here, that's it. Your tournament run is over. Yeah. Okay, oh, wow. Caught the step Again. back. I mean, he was already starting it before the step back even happened. Like, that's how much he knew about that one. Good Lord. Yeah, Ethan, is, he's all over fortune right telling. now. Yeah, basically. He had the tarot cards on deck. He was just <laughs> flipping them. He's like, ah, yes, the tower. That is my neutral sig. Oh, man. I was, I was in his horoscope. Ooh. You will be neutral sig for backdashing today. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, yeah, he's kind of stuck over the side. I'm surprised he didn't go for that weapon, but, you know, it looks like he tried to, you know, get a little cheeky with it. Gets back. Oh! Oh, my gosh, the damage. And he's, st he's still not going for the weapon. Okay. Weapon now. He's just happy side. to fight unarmed. You know I, what? I, I, Honestly, I think he doesn't care. He does not care at all. He's about to lap Lil Capped on this stock. Okay. 
Yeah, he's dead. Nice. Oh. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. I give it up. Yeah, that because that's the thing. Like when you dash that stomp, it doesn't like halt you immediately, so you can slide over the corner sometimes. And Lil Capped, he's been playing this legend, this weapon for so incredibly long. He just knew and was ready. All right, I got to dip low this time to secure the knockout. Damn. Well, I mean, even though Lil Cap just sitting in the red, he's doing a decent job of adding at least some type of oh, uh, some type of damage onto Ethan on his second stock. And Ethan's gonna take a little bit more damage either way, anyway because he is mm. playing a uh, Hatori. However. These gravity cancel side stakes definitely working out in his favor. Another one. Yeah, Ethan's been like, and we, we've seen this time and again throughout this set already. He has been so good at gravity canceling those signatures at just the right height where it still catches grounded opponents. It like scrapes their forehead. You can't duck yeah. under it. You're going to get caught and it catches people that are just jumping in the air. Man, that's like the third time he's went for it, and he's almost always correct. First few times he was just off in the spacing, but this time it looks like uh, Ethan is starting to catch on. Oh, he's oh dash dance! Oh my gosh, just poking him full of holes, Swiss cheese. Okay. Oh, very close to try to get in that uh that neutral air. Oh, almost close to actually picking that up uh, with the side air as well. Little Cap has to make a massive comeback here. He's about to be knocked out. Oh! Oh, oh he, he gets the bear. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can't, like, dodge into that bear. It will yeah. catch you. It's delayed enough. Like, yeah, there's totally dodge when... Oh. It didn't Ethan matter. with the neutral sig. Again, off the top. And that's a quick, clean 3-0 victory for Ethan. Yeah, man. That was... Uh, honestly, low cap was getting a lot of uses at that downlight uh, in sig, man. That was the second time. Mm. The first time he got it just off damage, but the second time he got it off the, off the KL. Again, as you were saying, one of those things where you can definitely jump away from. You don't have to use your dodge, but because, oh, yeah. you know, people are trying to, like, I guess they're looking for the downlight uh, side air that they end up getting scooped up by that instead. Uh, either way, Absolutely. Uh, you know, even if even if he does get a nice hit, uh, Ethan has it, had a whole nice set to play, and he, uh, he did that thing perfectly. So good stuff to Ethan. Taking it 3-0, we'll be moving on. Yeah, so unfortunately...